Hi everyone. I just wanted to do a video on my nail varnish collection. So this is what I keep my nail varnishes in. All lovely and jam packed. So I'm just going to move some stuff out the way because I've just been doing some other videos. Getting some out the way. So first of all, in this box, I have Nail Envy and this is in matte so you can use this if you like work in a kitchen or wherever like basically if you, if you want a nail varnish on your nails but you don't you're not really allowed to use nail varnish like like especially girls that get interested in nail care whatever but they can't wear nail varnish for school you can use this one because it'll dry on matte and it won't look like you've got anything on so i love that and then I have the Nail Envy Original, this can like, I mean I've got this one as a top coat at the minute, but it's not really that good, but it works as a nail strengthener, it's not meant to be a top coat, but it looks really good, and it's like, this is the best, it's by OPI as well, it's seen as the Nail Envy Matte one, this is like the best nail strengthener I've ever come across, so brilliant. Next we have a Barry M Nail Paint. And I love, love this one. I'm really loving the Barry M collection at the minute. I don't know why, but I love it. This isn't, by the way, the colour that I've got on my nails. This is a nail zinc one. But this was not mine. This was my mum's, so I don't know what it was called. But this colour is called Bright Pink 269. And I love it. Then I have a Nailene French Manicure White Tip. Now these ones really last on your nails and I love like this because like when I've gotten nail varnishes in the past for like French manicure they've never really lasted so I love this and it really does last and it is like bright bright white which is what I love. Then I've got a nailing pen so if I'm not using this I'll use this instead and you just basically like, I'm not going to get out because it will go everywhere, but you would just go like that on your nail. Like as you can see. You would just do that and you would basically just draw it on. Which is great, love it. And I've got like a white pencil. And basically as you can see, it's just like that. It does need a bit of sharpening done to work, but you just basically go under your nail. And you've got a French manicure and it really makes it underneath your nail look a lot whiter. So I like that. And then this is from Marks and Spencers. I've had this for ages. I don't know if it's still gonna work. But it's like it's a that's a nail brightener and it really makes like yellow nails look a lot brighter. It really, really makes your nails look healthy. And then I have a nail gel. Basically you put this on, leave it for five minutes, put it in water. Do it again, put it in water and it lift any dirt or like, especially use this if I've had tan on for ages. My nails are looking really yellow. Use this and it looks brilliant. So I love that. It really gets the whites of your nails back. But if you leave it on for too long, I also have to say, it will make your nails go see through. So don't leave it on longer than five minutes or however long it stays it looks. I don't know if they've changed it. And then I have a Leighton Denny nail varnish. Sorry, my nose is really itchy. And this is in butterfly wings, and I'll use this if I've got French manicure on, or just by itself with a nice top coat. Really makes the nails look healthy. And another tip for you: don't want when you like a nail varnish goes like that, don't shake it because that what makes it go up the neck, and then you know when you kind of get your the tops of your nail varnishes. That's why. So just don't do like don't shake it just rub it in your hands like that and that does the same job but it doesn't go up the neck and it won't dry and make your nail bottom just as, like have to be thrown out basically. Then I have a nice red as you can see and this is by Rimmel and this is in double decker. Double decker red and I love that really nice red to use. And then I have this number seven stay perfect and this is in Rose Truffle. I don't really like this nail varnish because it's too of a, a rush red or rosy red. I don't really like that one. I got a free anyway, so can't really complain. And I've got some nail zinc stuff. 
This is nearly sink red for the hills. It's quite nice, Beverly Hills. Then I nearly sink top coat. And then a nail zinc base coat. And then a nail zinc the hills pink and this is in Hollywood. I don't really like the nail zinc ones because they go on too matte and you definitely do need a top coat because they go really matte on the nails when you put it on. And then I've got a, a speed to dry nail varnish. From, sorry, it's leaked down the side of it. This is by number seven, and this is in hot pink. So I like that. And I've just got like a coral colour. Confessions says coral. This is by OPI. Nice colour. It looks red in sunlight for some reason. Don't know why. Then I've got a Rimmel Pro one, and that's got like that brush on it, where it's like easy to put on the stage free basically. I'm not going to show you all because some of them are like really crap basically. Like ones that are really drying out. What else can I show you? I've got a Jessica one. That one's had it on its way out but that one's in 11 Ivory. Um, that's it. Oh yeah I've gotten this one but I hate it because it just dries far too quickly. It dries literally in 40 seconds and it is not a nice colour. It is in, I don't know, I don't like it anymore. Um, so yeah, that is it. Oh, and just another tip for you, if you're going to put cuticle oil on, I don't have any in here, but if you're going to put cuticle oil on, put it on after all your nails are dry, and then your nail varnish won't slide off basically and it looks really nice so keeps the nails like really tidy and yeah that's it basically so thanks for watching and take care and i'll see you all in my next video don't forget again to subscribe rate and comment i love watching everyone's like videos i love like lollipop 26's videos and so what can make up really good really good videos watch them all the time so you have to watch them videos um i love watching videos like on youtube always get lovely tips off them and also don't forget to check out my blog it's lsbeautybeauty at blogspot.com so check that out and um, yeah just let me know if you want to see any videos of me to do that's it so again don't forget to oh, subscribe, rate and comment and I do get back to everyone's comments and messages. So anything you want to ask me, send it in or any videos you think I should do. So yeah, thanks, bye.